Welcome to the shop. Today I'm here to talk to you guys. Yeah, third gen Dodge Ram owners with the Cummins. We need to talk about the wiring that goes across the back of the engine bay. You know, I'm not sure what I'm talking about. Let's check it out. All right, so this wiring right in here. You see that? You see how it's all cracked and falling apart? I actually added some in there before, but that's starting to crack and fall apart now too. The problem is that it's located right over top of this heat area right here with the exhaust coming out and the turbo down in there. And uh, well, let's face it, you know, eventually that's just gonna get too hot and those wires will melt together and well, then we'll have a fire on our hands. So today I got some wire wrap. Well, that's a heat insulating blanket thing and some heat tape. And we're gonna maybe even use some of these little new wire ties here. But we're gonna take that sucker off the back firewall there, wrap it in something that's gonna protect it a little bit better and then put it back together. little wrap all the wires come in now I did end up adding um, a couple of extra wires for a switch pod that I'm putting in um, so that's all wrapped up in there and then I use some zip tie to the firewall little pieces in there and uh, much better so this heat coming off of here isn't gonna affect those wires at all and we're safe well that is it for today thanks for stopping out we're still working on other parts of this RAM, but that's all we're gonna put into this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it was useful. And if you have a RAM like this, you should probably take care of that because eventually it's gonna come back to bite you. Maybe. I don't know. Have a good one. Like and subscribe if you'd like. We'll see you on the next one. <laughs>